Hello audience, I'm Jin Penguendova, the South Pole's most popular, most famous film director, its most handsome bachelor. I'm very popular on social media. Film premieres are always a blast, but movies are my first love. Action! You don't know the drama I've been through with my ex. They made on the TV. She gave him a rose. Some women are real aggressive. So here I am, out cruising the highway, and you know, she's just living it up with my ex. Yeah. They adopted a puppy. Who would have thought? Yep, just you and me, kid. I'm so upset right now. I don't know what's going on in my life, and the disco themed wedding cake they had, all oh, that really got me. The disco themed wedding cake was just a killer for me. But here I am, I set that beach house ablaze. They didn't know anything about it. <laughs> it was real funny. Let's go put some gas. You know what, Buster? You're gonna wait here in the car. I love samosas. Oh, okay, so I don't really. Oh, <gasps> my son's in the car! What are we gonna do to him? Look, the car's on fire! Cut. Who threw the green screen on the ocean? I have a new script for you. When I get inspired, I cannot stop writing. My brain is transported into another dimension where creativity is the only air I breathe. Beauty and the Beast, a special remake, done Penguin Dova style with intrigue, mystery, jealousy and revenge. Penelope was distressed today. You shall play the lead. Damn, I don't think I can do this part. I need something where I can disappear into the character. Horrible news. Penelope is my muse. Because my beauty is not an asset, it's a curse. In my beauty and the beast, it is the leading lady who is cursed with beauty. Only the one who falls in love with her inner beauty may rescue her. Many try and fail because they don't love her for who she is. Eureka, the plot is ready. Our heroine spent every night flying over Tokyo, gifting night terrors to every one with her magic wand. I must stay up all night and finish the screenplay. The Duchess of Nightmares knew her greatest fears. She longed that every person who was ever mean to her had a restless night, because she felt their contributed to her unhappiness. I saw it with my own eyes, destruction she caused. It was real to the dreamers. But at the end of the night, the Duchess didn't drift up to sleep. She remained in her own living nightmare from day to night. Nothing she did freed her. Only true love could break the spell. I shall find a book today that will inspire my next Oscar winning screenplay. There is a poetry aisle, so I may get it to work. 
This is a library. Never mind, I found it. This is a library. Is this person called Sandberg an important poet? He had never heard such beautiful poetry, nor understood how he knew the words. You'll come one day in a waver of love, tender as dew, impetuous as rain. The tan of the sun will be on your skin, the perfect breeze in your murmuring speech. You will pose with a hill's flower grace. You will come with your slim, expressive arms, a poise of the head no sculptor has caught, and nuances spoke of a shoulder and neck. Your face in a past and a past of moods has many a skies and delicate change of cloud and blue and flimmering sun. Yet you may not come, O oh girl of a dream. We may but pass as the world goes by and take from a look of eyes into eyes a film of hope and a memory day. Suddenly, her face appeared in the water, and he knew this wasn't a regular dream. It was magical. Mr. Penguidivar, it is a privilege to be working with you once again on product placements. Our corporate division loved the last film. Are, 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 you do are, are you doodling kittens? No. I am offering you millions of dollars for product placement, and you are wasting my time drawing common alley cats on notebook paper? British short hack kittens, sir. I suggest for the next action film, you remove all of the plot and replace it with a story about the cars. Never. I'm a auteur of cinema. Sure you are, but imagine the joy of having a new car. Millions of dollars for having that new car in the movie. You could win a lot of Academy Awards for this movie for special effects and other categories. You could fit the Oscars into the backseat of your expensive new luxury vehicle. I will take the money. There will be no plot. I'd like a McGrill sandwich, small square oh. fries, large anchovy fries, oh. and six large coffees. I have a stupendous film idea. There is a joke. What do you call a Mac Penguin burger in France? A Creel Sandwich Royale. <laughs> the film has two funny men. One gets a new girlfriend. She says, don't be a square. You'll never make it in Hollywood. Hello, new car. I love you. Hey, who are you? Peter Jackson always parks in the no parking zone. I am a gold glove winner. I can do whatever I want. This is worse than that time I lost best director to Ang Lee for Life of Pi. Cursed? That's it. In the next chapter, the Duchess of Nightmares explains how she is cursed with the beauty. It is my grandest wish that you could rescue me from my everlasting nightmares. Yeah, what's up? I don't remember who I was, but I was a ghost in a lady's restroom, and the witch kidnapped me. Pretty soon, I wasn't in the lady's restroom no more. I was in Kyoto, Japan. Like, are you kidding me? Japan? <laughs> The witch cursed me with beauty. The witch said she did it because when you are beautiful, nobody cares to know the real you. All they focus on is on the exterior. Do you think you can rescue me? Save me, man up. Get some muscle tone. Cause you need to bust me out of this joint. Real soon. When the last cherry blossom petal falls on the brick, wah, well, I'm gonna be the ghost of a ghost. And that ain't pretty. She took Prince Charming into the hallway of Curse Mirrors to show him what happens when a ghost dies again. He had met her before outside of Dreamland, but where? Come over here. Take a closer look in the mirrors. What do you see? You see those ghosts are ghosts. When I die as a ghost, my heart will burst into a million pieces all over the room and beyond. I thought ghosts could return to meet the living. How can I possibly save you? Well, that's the thing, you see. When you die the second time, you never really come back. 
and I'll be trapped in these mirrors forever. Do you think I want that? No. I just wish I knew who I was. When she revealed her insecurities, Prince Charming saw her as a real girl. My mind is tired. I cannot stop drinking coffee. My heart needs more inspiration. I must travel. Where can I go? Mexico? Brazil? Perhaps Canada? I need more coffee. Canada! Moose Mounties Food Canada! Hello. Get me a taxi this instant to the airport. I must go to Canada for inspiration for my next award-winning film. I can't stop drinking Canada. coffee. It's so Do I get Does Canada. Canada have coffee? Very expensive good coffee. I want more coffee now. Are there panda bears in Canada? Why do I have a suitcase? Penguins don't use clothes. Does the airplane have free Wi-Fi? Coffee! I'm glad you like my movie kids, but no autographs until you buy me some free coffee. I want more coffee, but I have to visit the toilet. Never mind, I will use the toilet on the airplane every five minutes. In Canada, I'm buying a leopard print swimsuit for the hotel swimming pool. What's with the goofy smile? Congratulations, like, to the recently, like, deceased. You're, like, dead now. That's, like, cool, right? Yeah, totally. Do you have any coffee around this? You're, like, so silly. We have, like, so many coffee beans up here, always sustainable and always decaffeinated. How can I be dead from drinking too much coffee? I shall finish the film. Dead or not, the Duchess and Nightmares may not have remembered who she was, but Prince Charming did. I can't take it anymore. I don't know what to do. I feel so small. All the people in the office hate me. And they all think I'm all their boyfriends. They think that I'm a loser. It's on the side of the building. <laughs> I know what they think of me. Do you think that I wish I could have changed their minds? Yeah, I could have just run away from my life. I know what they say about me. I read it, I see it, I hear it. And they just wish I could disappear. I wish that I wouldn't be alive anymore because then nobody would miss me. Running away, I'm 10 inches tall, running away from who I am. And I don't know why I'm this way. I just wish I could be dead. I wish I could be dead, and no longer around. <laughs> Prince Charming understood he could only rescue her within a dream. He took control of his surroundings and commanded his dream to change into a pirate ship adventure soon. The ship set sail. <laughs> Captain, there be ghosts in the sea. Ah, head north to the rocky island. But the ghosts could kill us. Fire up the cannons and blast them to smithereens, crew! <laughs> Tis in the distance! Put me in the cannon and fire me to the beach! <laughs> but it was too late. The Duchess was fading. PTSD, post traumatic stress disorder. That's what this is. I was a firefighter, and because I couldn't save the children I saw in the burning building, then I am forever, every night, trapped in a nightmare. But you know what? I forgive myself. 
I will no longer be trapped in the shadows of the past. I will move on. I know that no matter what, I can't control what others say about me or do, but I know that I am a good person and I do the best job I can every day. At last, I'm finally free. Can someone turn that down? I can't hear myself thinking at all. The patient suffered cardiac arrest, died for a minute, and slipped into a coma. Were he not famous, we wouldn't have given him specialized medical treatment. He might wake up tomorrow. Let's get a midnight snack. Getting sick was the most prolific thing I've ever done. I must finish my screenplay in time for the next week. Nurse, please bring me my typewriter.